Yo, what's up guys? I'm Robert Z1 and in today's Grand Theft Auto Online video, I will show you my top 10 glitches, tips, and tricks. I hope you enjoy this video. Today's Grand Theft Auto Online video, I will show you how to wear any helmet with mask after the new update. Before I get started, if you enjoy my content, hit the bell icon to get notifications about my channel, hashtag notification squad. And if you like the video, slap a like and subscribe. Okay, the first thing you need to do is drive to this location on the map. Now pick the mask you want to put with the helmet. I'll be picking the Abominable Snowman mask. Now start a CEO, then hold down select, go to style, auto show bike helmet and turn on. Now go to bike helmet and pick the helmet you want with the mask. I'll be picking a tan bulletproof helmet. Now go to Securo Serve CEO Management CEO Style and hit one to the right to Founder. Now get on your motorcycle. When your character starts to put on his helmet, switch back to none. You should have the bulletproof helmet on the mask. Quickly run to the top section and save the outfit. If you have problems saving the helmet mask outfit, delete the slot and save over the outfit. In today's Grand Theft Auto Online video, I will show you how to get the cop outfit after the new update. Rockstar has been removing people's saved outfits. With this new method, you'll be able to save the cop outfit again. Okay, let's get right into the video. The first thing you need to do is start a CEO, go to management style, and switch the outfit one to the left. Once you're on Demon, go to jobs, play jobs, Rockstar created, versus crooked cop. You'll need one other player to do this glitch. Set the outfits to classic, then start the job then switch your outfit to Justice. Once the job starts up, hold down select, go to style, helmet visor, and hit right on the D-pad for about 30 seconds, then put the controller down and wait until you get kicked for idling. For PS4, I heard that you have to go to Netflix or YouTube. I'm on Xbox One, so all I have to do is put the controller down and wait for three minutes to get kicked for idling. Now once you get kicked for idling, spam on A. When you load in, you should have the demon outfit without the mask. All you have to do from here is go to CEO management style and hit one to the right. You should have the cop outfit. Change the gloves and save the outfit. And like I said before, gaming online is all about looking unique and different and having the cop outfit after the new update will definitely set you apart from the rest. Been a long time coming, but now I'm here. And if rap was boots, these dudes is mountain gear. And I'm a fresh pair of Tim constructs with no stuff. Stomping through these in today's Grand Theft Auto Online video, I will show you how to get rare body armor for your female character after the new update. Okay, the first thing you need to do is go to tops, fitted suit jackets, and pick any blazer. Here are the blazers you can pick from. Now hold down select, go to inventory body armor, auto show armor on, and pick any body armor. You can now pick rare body armor. You can make some really sick outfits using this glitch. As you can see here, you cannot normally get these rare body armors without using this glitch. Save the outfit and you're done. Like I said before, gaming online is all about looking unique and different and having a rare body armor on your female character will definitely set you apart from the rest. In today's Grand Theft Auto Online video, I will show you how to wear black camouflage and brown pants with the new bodysuit, and I'll also show you how to change the mask after the new update. First thing you need to do is go to the clothing store and pick any bodysuit. Each bodysuit gives you a different pair of pants. I believe the first pair gives you brown, the second pair gives you camouflage, and the last pair gives you black. Now go to the barbershop and pick any chest hair. Now pick shaved. Now wait for 10 seconds, then go to contacts. Now pick any contacts. When you back out, you should have a different pair of pants on your bodysuit. Now to change the mask, save the outfit and go to your apartment. Now change the mask. In my case, I'll be using a juggernaut mask. Now run to the telescope and quickly hit right on the D-pad twice. You should be standing in front of the telescope. Now hold down select, go to style, and pick the outfit with the bodysuit mask. When you walk away from the telescope, you should have the juggernaut mask on a bodysuit outfit. Save the outfit and you're done. Like today's Grand Theft Auto Online video, I will show you how to get any necklace on a black t-shirt after the new update. Okay, let's get right into the video. The first thing you need to do is go to vest and pick the QB Navy sweater vest. 
Now go to accessories and pick the necklace you want with the black t-shirt. Now go back to top, overcoat blazer and pick no top. You should have the necklace with the black t-shirt. You can't normally get the necklace on a t-shirt so this outfit is definitely unique and different. Save the outfit. Like I said before, gaming online is all about looking unique and different and having a necklace with black t-shirt will definitely set you apart from the rest. If you enjoy glitches like this, click on my GTA outfit clothing glitches playlist. In today's Grand Theft Auto Online video, I will show you a sick god mode glitch after the new update. You can't use guns or see players, but the players can see you. This glitch is cool for trolling friends and just having some fun. Okay, let's get right into the video. The first thing you need to do is set the spawn location to the apartment you'll be driving your car into the garage of. Now drive any car out of the garage, then drive it back into the garage you set the apartment spawn location to. Now quickly go online and find a new session. When you spawn into your apartment, all you have to do is hold down select, go to kill yourself. You should spawn outside. You know you did the glitch correct if the apartment building is invisible and glitched out. In today's Grand Theft Auto Online video, I will show you how to get modded pants, modded skirt, and I'll also show you how to wear any necklace with no vest. And I'll also show you a sick CEO office wall breach after the new update. Okay, let's get right into the video. To get the modded pants, pick the outfit you want to remove the top from, then go to style and pick appearance. This will cost you a little bit, so if you don't have money, don't try this glitch. Once you're in character appearance, go to crew t-shirt to remove the top, then save the appearance. This also works with the robe to get the modded skirt. Now to get any necklace with no shirt, the first thing you need to do is pick any vest. Now pick the necklace you want to have with no shirt. Now pick any heavy utility vest, then pick no utility vest. You will notice that you will have no shirt with the necklace. You can make some really sick outfits using this glitch. Okay now for the CEO wall breach. The first thing you're going to do is get a motorcycle and drive to this location on the map. Once you're at this location on the map, drive through the wall breach in this location. Now drive off the edge as you see me do in the video. Now go in and out of first person until you see the garage. This is a cool place to explore and just have fun with friends. a long time coming, but now I'm here, and if rap was boots, these dudes is mountain gear, and I'm a fresh pair of Tim Constructs with no stuff, stomping through these brook long blocks that's so rough, E. Greasy got shot, raw shooting heroin. Today's Grand Theft Auto Online video, I will show you how to get invisible arms after the new update. Okay, let's get right into the video. The first thing you need to do is start a CEO, then hold down select, go to Securo Serve, CEO, Management, CEO, Style, and pick the outfit to premiere. Now go online, Jobs, Play Jobs, Rockstar Created, Survival, and start the Maze Bank Survival. Now once the Maze Bank Survival starts up, hold down select, go to Style, Helm Advisor, and hit right on the D-pad for about 20 or 30 seconds. Then pull up your phone and quit the Maze Bank Survival. Once you load online, go to Securo Serve, CEO, Management, CEO, Style, and change your outfit to none. You should still be wearing a Premier outfit. 
Now go online, jobs, play jobs, Rockstar created, missions, and start tightening up a job. When the mission starts up, head over to any ammunition, go to tops, utility vests, and pick the black heavy utility vest. Then go to overcoat blazers and pick no tops. You should have invisible arms. Save the outfit and find a new session. When you load online, when you pick the invisible arms outfit, you will notice your arms will reappear. To make the invisible arm stick, go to a yacht, start a CEO, go to management CEO style and pick the outfit the demon. Now walk into the jacuzzi, then retire CEO. Now throw sticky bombs in this location of the jacuzzi. Now start a CEO again, then blow yourself up. When you spawn in, you should have the swimming trunks. Go to your wardrobe and pick the outfit with the invisible arms. You should still have invisible arms as long as you don't change your CEO. If you enjoy glitches like this, click on my GTA outfit clothing glitches playlist. If you're new to my channel, why not subscribe? Follow me on Google Plus. I upload all the awesome showcase glitches, tips, and tricks. That's all I have for you today. I'll see you guys in my next video.